collect about 90, 90 recipes, including breakfast, lunch, dinner, pizzas and uh, paninis, burgers, about 90s. about 90, 90 recipes, including breakfast, lunch, dinner, pizzas and uh, paninis, burgers, about 90s. Uh, our hometown, uh, our region, uh, is, um, uh, which is Emilia Romagna and Tuscany, so it's, uh, which are two very famous uh, worldwide recognized uh, type of cuisine. We, I'm lucky enough to have a chef from my hometown, Christian, which, is, which I know since, uh, since long time and has been with the company for over five years now. It brings real authenticity to the to the to our menus. We work very very close very closely. We decide on the menu together. We decide what we think is 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 the best option, the best offer. But of course, I leave it to him when it comes to recipe. I don't I don't interfere. I don't interfere too much. He knows where to source the best quality, which is a paramount importance in our restaurants. He has a very good relationship with our suppliers. He pushes our suppliers as well. That's what is good to have in Malaysia. Suppliers need that that the supply chain, the suppliers, they need that push from 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 us. Uh, you know, we need certain ingredients, and uh, if we don't push them, they are not motivated to find. A new, new, new option. He's very good at that. So when it comes to new idea, new options, new, new menus, uh, he's a chef to, to, to decide. He's Christian to decide. Okay. We bring a, a, again a cuisine that is very regional. It's quite, it's quite niche. Like a, I like to say, Tuscan and Emilia Romagna is, is a key of our menu. We really try to uh, propose that type of awesome food. Uh, which is uh, high quality, obviously, very, very um, nice in, in, in the look and in, and in, uh, in um, uh, options that we, we, we have. It goes from meat, seafood, pastas, pizzas. Uh, chefs, Christian is, is an expert, he's a real pizza chef. He really brings a selection of pizzas that are not the typical one. Of course, we have the classic, but we have a lot of our options as well. Uh, we bring that flair, the Italian flair that everyone expects, not just in the food but in the service as well. Uh, it's not just the restaurant, it's about the ambience of an Italian we, restaurant, which is about the music, it's about the, 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 the familiarity, the smile, the, the type of, I would say, package or experience that is not just about the food but is, you know, you, 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 you experience it the moment you walk in. Okay, uh, as you can see, I'm preparing our carpaccio, the previously I put in the chili at zero degree, <clears throat> so at least can take a little bit of consistency in the meat and easy to cut with our slice machine for give the real flavor of the meat and thinly slice. And then I put some salt and pepper and a little bit of lemon dressing, our lemon dressing. And then <clears throat> we have some rocket salad as well. Also this one, salt, pepper, lemon dressing. We mix it. And then, okay. This one we put in the middle. This one is a starter. It's a Howard Shield Australia Beef Carpaccio from Fresh. And then Grana Padano as well. This one a little bit to spread it. It's done. Actually, it's already done. If they finish the plate, they come back like that, I'm very happy. For me, it is an emotion, it's experience. It's the same thing that I want to give to my customer. So if I see them happy that uh, taking one piece of bread they finish also the last sauce that uh, are dirtying the, the plate, uh, this is a satisfaction. It's something that uh, really makes you proud. Proud of my, me and uh, all the people that I have around to me as well. Uh, we saw the opportunities in this area of Kuala Lumpur. Uh, within the Petra Cucina we have uh, restaurants that they mainly cover the city center of Kuala Lumpur. Bangsa, in our opinion, was lacking. This, uh, this option and uh, a lot of our regulars and patrons always said when are you starting moving to when are you opening in banks around the Mansara or PJ so we saw the opportunity there we are uh, very grateful to our patrons and guests that they've been supporting us for, for for many years but they don't always feel like coming to 
to the city. They, they like to stay close to their home and uh, being able to experience that. We found in Bangsa Shopping Center the perfect location and um, we decided to take it and uh, come into Bangsa in, in offering the Italian flair that the Petra Cucina is, is famous for. F&B is really, is really my, is my passion more than my, my business. I, I don't look at F&B as a, as a job, as something that I need to wake up in the morning uh, and have to go because it's a job. It's really a passion. I look forward to it. I really don't mind spending 14 hours a day in, in a restaurant. So it's a, I just love it. Okay, when we receive the, the, a, nice, a nice message or a nice phone call and say, thank you guys, we had a great time. Uh, I mean, everyone comes to a restaurant to celebrate some event. It could be a birthday, it could be the promotion, it could be a, the first kid, you know, birthday. It could be, it could be a, a proposal. We see that every day, you know, but, you know, we cannot take it for granted. This, this, the customer comes here to celebrate something that's going to be very important for them in their life. And we really love it when, first of all, they choose our restaurant to, to celebrate it. And then when they had a great time, that a memorable time, that is to me one of the best, uh, one of the best moments. When it comes to real quality, to real focus on, on, on a product, people are uh, more, you know, toned to something that is really authentic. And when it comes to restaurants, you know, they will always remember you for your uh, quality, authenticity and consistency. And banks, uh, when it comes to Italian restaurants, is probably, as area, is probably lacking that. Fine dining nowadays can be a, a fine dining quality, a fine dining service, but at the same time you don't have to pay fine dining price to add that. So I would say Roberto is a friendly restaurant, but high-end when it comes to quality and, and uh, service uh, and, and experience uh, package.